Uh, hello everybody, my name is Paul Anthony Williams, or you can call me Paul, and welcome to part 5 of Pikmin. I say for today we are going to go back to the Forest Naval, try to see if we can collect uh, as many parts as we can on this day. Okay. Not gonna be that tough of a day, but you know, we I can do this. I'm just gonna take out all of our blues and a few yellows. We're gonna come over here. Now these rocks you can actually get nectar from. Alright, let's hope let's hope let's hope I get lucky. Come on. Well, we only have one leaf, but you know, it's fine. Come on. And over here we have the... I found my number one Iodium Jet. Unfortunately, this puts out a slight... This puts out a slightly odorous, odorous exhaust, but it does propel me to escape velocity in an instant. The scent is small price to pay for such performance. Alright, they're going to carry this back. Oh, darn it. Yeah, I hate when that happens. Alright, but it should be fine. While they're carrying that back, we can go get our yellow Pikmin, or I can go get my yellow Pikmin to blow up a few things. Alright, oh, one tripped. Yeah, very helpful if you have your Pikmin trip for you. I mean, if there was a Pikmin that, that was tripping. All right. So I want to get at least out uh, 15 yellows. And we're going to make the rest reds. Number one, I owe him jet. If this is damaged, I'll be in dire straits. I will have to run a system check as soon as I can. Alright, now we just have alright, now we just have uh, three parts that we have to get today. And we have a uh, leaf pickman straggling, but one that fell down. Yeah, very helpful. Very helpful to do that. Alright, so I'm just gonna get some bomb rocks. Yeah, there's this guy in the way, but he's not too much of a problem. Alright, uh, all groups together. Alright, we're gonna get past this, uh, blow hog. Oh, be careful with these fire geysers here. You know, I like to lean them up against the wall. Alright. Main group for today. Uh, the yellows and some of the reds are, are going to have to work on this bridge. Alright. 
All right. Oh yeah, you can't throw your Pikmin over the over the uh, ledge if you if you want to be cruel, but you know. All right, now we just need the the blues to uh, carry this back. I found my analog computer. This computer this computer converts the kind of of vague data that fail that falls outside of the range of of ones and zeros. Actually, to be honest, it's a little bit too vague, so it isn't very helpful. Alright, so they're going to carry that out, but there are fire geysers in the way, so, uh... No, no. Come on. So they're going to carry that back. Meanwhile, we're going to try finishing this bridge out. And they're just carrying it through just fine. Just like I said, red, red Pikmin are immune to fire. Ah. Anyway, this is probably like the only day when I will use like all three types of Pikmin. Well, besides the final area, but or the final day, but yeah, we'll we'll wait and see. Oh yeah, I should like to say that after this part, I'm probably not going to use reds for the rest of the. Pl I'm probably not going to use reds until like the final final area. Anyway, you need yellows. You need to throw yellows up here, or if you can trick shot, I can't trick shot, but you can trick shot reds up here. I found my Libra. My daughter gave this to me. It's named after her astrology sign. My sweet little girl. I wonder what she's doing right now at at this moment. All right, guys, come on, get up. And some of them became buds because they fell off. Ah darn it. I, I hope I didn't I hope I didn't mess this up. Alright, now the uh reds are gonna no all I'm gonna try throwing all my reds on here. Come on. Now there is one more ship part I now there is one more ship part that uh, I am I'm gonna try getting. And it is a re and it is imperative that you need forty blues. <laughs> Alright, come on. Let's get out of here. Uh, I can leave my yellows uh I can leave my yellows right here. Where are you gonna carry that? Okay. Because out in the water, you'll find this weird Japanese bottle, but also another ship part. So my best strategy is not to fight these things, but to lure them away. Analog computer. This, strength this strengthens the outward emotions of the dolphin's computer. While it makes the... While it does make the computer smart, it also makes it quick to anger. Just It's just like my boss. Come on. I know you want to hit me. It's, uh, it's the anti-dioxide filter. This fits over the rocket's exhaust port and filters out all the, all the disease-causing agents from the planet's exhaust. That means I'll be able to move around without polluting the planet's atmosphere. I I feel I feel worlds better. So, 
So another trick is that you can get the camera off an enemy, and the enemies will stay in place for a little while. I think it has something to do with the AI. Hey. No. Oh, another way to distract enemies is to hit them, because they'll go into their attacking state. Thus, uh, stalling them. Libra, my daughter gave this to me. My late return must have her very worried. Hey, hey, look at me. Okay. So, they're all going to carry that back. But yeah, that is the last part for today. Uh, you know what? Since this is it, since this is going to be a bit shorter, I'm going to try doing an extra day in this part. So I'm so I am going to end the day early, but. But I will try to. Uh, but on the not but in the next area just want to get them nectared i'm going to try doing another part today uh, I, i'm going to try doing another day today so that way we get another part anti dioxide filter the laws of deep space require all ships to to eliminate all pollution. Alright. So I'm going to next them up. And then I'm going to end the day. Alright. I see two that need it. Alright. Let's end the day. I said that was pretty good. No deaths. No deaths. And no eating here tonight. Day five sent impact. There are now only twelve parts that I that I still need to retrieve. Will I be able to recover the remaining parts in twenty five more days? Certainly, there are some parts that are not it, absolutely necessary. If my ship is not complete by thirty days, the only way I will find out is to try to lift off. I just recall the day I took my son for a ride in this spaceship. He was so happy. I shall tell him the jur this journey when I return, and, and I shall return. I must. I can already see the, the look of wonder on his precious face as I describe my adventures with the Pikmin. So, one thing to say is you don't need all 30 parts. Five of them are optional. And, uh, sometimes you get, like, a special text to... That will, that Omar will explain about his life. Like, he can explain, like, gameplay tutorials, or, you know, he can, or he can, or he can't. It, it's, it all depends. I'm feeling 40. I can only take out 40. So, this day is kind of important, as we need to raise some blues. Anyway, this is like the... Anyway, the, we're back at the beginning of the game, the impact site. You know, say like you lost like a bunch of Pikmin because you're new or you're just careless or you just don't care. Well, you can spend a day at the impact site to uh, get some Pikmin back. Now, I'm not going to grow Pikmin for the rest of this part. <laughs> or the rest of the playthrough. I'm just here for something else. One, to get 90 Pikmin... So I guess I am here to raise some.
So this is a new type of enemy, the Pearly Clam Clam. And we'll... I'll get on to how to fight it, but right now I'm just doing it the quick way. Alright, I guess, I guess I'll show you how to fight it. You, you throw your Pikmin, but then it will reel back. Once it reels far back enough, it will clamp down. Any Pikmin that any Pikmin that are in, that are in the way will get will uh, get eaten. So you just need to be careful. So I think it will take a while for them to fight. Okay, okay, they're all out of the way. Anyway, you want to get that pearl. But, we but there's something else. That's not a pearl. That's something weird. I found my, my Histron Jet, Positron Generator, darn it. Now, now people are going to make fun of me by calling it a Pistron. By combining battery, battery to solar cells, this machine can generate incredible amounts of electricity. What a timely find. Those types of space noodles will taste better, better heated. Anyway. Anyway, there is something special about this, uh... There is something special about this, uh, thing, though. Anyway, I... Hey, you know what? I'm gonna- I'm gonna throw out some reds out here. I I'm gonna pull out some reds. You know, this is gonna be, like, their final part before the finale. And let's see if I can, uh, trigger it. Oh. Yeah, that beetle thing that, that we saw earlier, that was a flint beetle. It said that... It, don't worry, it won't, har it won't harm the Pikmin, though. But it is said that they can, uh... That they have nectar that the Pikmin want. Anyway, take this to the, uh... Blue, on blue onion. And look at the counter. But first... Positron generator. This electric generator is so powerful that if you approach it carelessly, you'll get an electric shock. Oh, we're at a 300. 300 Pikmin. Anyway, anyway, before we end the day, I want to flower all these blues for the uh, next area. Make sure they're all together. Go in. Come on, we have two left. I want, I want, I want them to be uh, nectarified. All right, we have a full battalion of of uh, blues that are nectared. Now I'm, not, I'm just gonna end the day. I'm, I'm not gonna spend the rest. Oh shoot! Darn it. Okay. Uh, we're, uh, give me one second. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm so sorry about that, but I had to replay the, uh, sixth day, so that should be fine. So, we are going to go to sunset. Anyway, sorry about that. But, hey, not too bad. 
So now we have 90 uh, blues. So I say that is a pretty good day for today. Wait a minute, we didn't see one of those in here. Six days since impact. I've seen that at times, the leaf of talks of a pigment's head will grow into a bud and then a flower. It appears that if I do not pick the pigment sprout, they gradually bloom over time. Fascinating. This melding of plants and animal traits will sure is surely unique in in the natural world. I found flower pigment to possess increased swiftness when in a rush I found I found holding, then calling the the flower pigment forth to be quite an effective strategy. I've also learned that new sprouts will found growing on days following fierce battles are the result of seeds being left behind. Basically what that means is if you lose a lot of Pikmin in battle, like a lot, sometimes during the next day there'll be other there'll be like a seed planted in the ground. Like new seeds planted where the battle where the enemy used to be. Anyway, that's uh, this this area done, this area done, and this area done. So, for the next few parts, we'll be going to the uh, distant spring. But for now, I'd say that it, that was a pretty good day that we did. So, uh, have a good day, everybody. My name is Paul Anthony Williams, and see you later.